everyone. Welcome to the Knitting Turnpike. This is a video series is part of my increase stitch series. Um, I'm going to be today, right now, this video is going to show you how to do the right lifted increase and the left lifted increase. Before I get into that, let me explain a little bit about this so that we can understand what we're going to be doing. When you're knitting and you come to a stitch, you have a stitch here. This is your right the right shoulder which is on my right this is my right and this is the left shoulder of your knit stitch which is on my left so right is on your right left is on your left to do the right lifted increase you're going to take the right shoulder pull it up with your right needle put it on your left hand stitch so that gives you an extra stitch. So this is like an increased stitch. Sorry, having a, a little bit of time grabbing that. There we go. Knit it through your back loop. And there you go. There's your increased stitch. It doesn't, the beautiful thing about this is it doesn't create any holes in your knitting, kind of like yarn overs do. So if you are making like a sweater and you need it to be smooth, you need to increase, um, add some extra stitches um, like along the bust line or maybe in the in the shoulders, um, in the um, under the arm area. This is a great way to do um, increased stitches without making holes. Um, so this was the stitch that I, I picked the right thing, the right shoulder on. I'm going to knit that. I'm going to do that again. To make a right lifted increase, you find that right shoulder on the stitch below the stitch that's on the left hand needle, pick it up, and then just knit it through the back loop. And that's your right lifted increase. Now if you want to do a left lifted increase, of course there's a left lifted increase. For the right, there's always a left. You want to knit the stitch, and then, because you got to um, knit it to get access to your um, stitch, you go to the stitch below the stitch you just knitted, which is this one. Pick it up with your right, with your left needle. Sorry, back to front, and then just knit it through the back loop. And that's a left lifted increase. I'm going to show you that again, and I want to also point out something else. So you lift, knit your next stitch to get to the left side. Now, if you were to take the stitch right below the one you just knitted, you would end up, if you can see, you've already got this, this stitch that's on the right-hand needle through that stitch. If you knitted this stitch through the back loop, you're just going to create a yarn over. and it would. So that's not the stitch to do. You have to go one below that stitch. To do your left knitted increase. Let me pull that out. So you don't, when you, after you knit your stitch, you don't use this one. You use this one to do your left knitted, left lifted increase. Sorry about that. So you pick it up, knit through the back loop, and voila, there's your left lifted increase. You can also see that the right left right lifted increase has a little bit of a right lean and your left lifted increase has a little bit of a left lean just like when you do the make one left and the make one right okay um if you have any questions about these two stitches um any comments please don't hesitate to list them below thank you so much for watching this video would love for you to subscribe to this channel um, hope you have a very wonderful day.